for them to get they put it coming back here. Now repeat my question and answer, please. <laughs> Thank, th thank you, Joe, for the question. One of the things, you can call me Burl, you don't have to call me Mr. Burl. As your next CEO, as your, next CEO you can always call me Burl. Uh, every contract over $50,000 in the CAD County has to go out for competitive bid. Contracts over $100,000 should also come to the Board of Commissioners for approval. I created an audit and contracts committee on the Board of Commissioners. And as wow. as, as, he has one minute. All right, thank you. Uh, what we discovered, and as a result of creating that audit and contracts review committee, is that several contracts were not following appropriate procedures. Let me give you an example. We found 17 contracts that were being overspent. The most egregious example, on one day, 11 county contracts just under the $50,000 threshold of $49,000 went to the same vendor on the same contract, 11 contracts. That in and of itself would have been a very bad violation. That should have been one contract for half a million dollars that should have been gone out with competitive bid, so you get the best return on your tax dollars, and then approved by the Board of Commissioners. What happened? That vendor was actually paid $3.7 million. Now, I believe in an open, transparent government. I stood for that. I fought for that. We got the endorsement of the Atlanta Journal-Constitution. That's one of the reasons they pointed out for giving us that endorsement was my strong advocacy on behalf of honest, transparent, effective government. I'll put my record up to anybody <laughs> on that, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Um, unfortunately, I'm going to burn this is an answer to the